Hey guys, uh, Coach Suns here from Eastern Suburbs uh, Football Club. As you're all aware about uh, the health uh, pandemic that's going on, um, we thought as a club it would be a good idea if we get some workouts to you guys that can be done in the safety of your home. Uh, we're going to run through some uh, exercises today and we'll put it in the format of a workout. I've got Martin Abuelo from the National League team here and he's going to be my uh, model for today and demonstrate all these movements and we'll just get straight to it. So for our workout one, the day which we can do in our living rooms, in our gardens, we're going to start with a squat. What we're going to do is, I want your feet placed shoulder width apart, hands straight in front, and very slowly, you're going to bend at the hips first, going down, making sure your knees point outwards, and come back up. And I'll get Martin to now face sideways, and he'll repeat the same movement. And squat, and go back up, and we'll do one more. Good, perfect. The main points in this, guys, is to ensure that when we start squatting on the downward motion, our knees do not come in. We've got to always make sure they're pointing outwards and we're not overreaching or what we call bending with the torso to get depth. Our next exercise in workout one is a press up. So Martin will go down and I want you to keep your elbows pointing back towards your feet. Nice and tight, nice and tight and he'll go down, come back up, one more. Now Martin will go to the side. All right, and elbows pointing back, and one more. Okay, stay there, Martin. So if you are finding it difficult, there is an easier way. So you'll go down onto your knees, walk your hands out just a little, and you're going to go down. One thing I want you to make sure we don't arc our back, and let's go down again, and back up, and cool. Our next exercise for workout one is a jack bag and we're gonna focus on that abdominal section so on the ground bar team so our starting point is sleeping flat back hands straight back I want you to very slightly raise your feet off the ground touch your ankles go back do two more good and now can we go sideways just so we get a better view and coming up and back. One more. I think Martin's already tired. <laughs> and cool. <laughs> next, next movement we call the Superman. So Martin will again demonstrate for you. That's not part of the movement. <laughs> but it was good effort anyway. So slide it with back, Martin. Keep Martin. coming back to me. Yeah, thank you. I want you to square your elbows up at a 90 degrees. And very slowly, you're going to raise your shoulders off the ground. And raise your legs, keeping this nice and tight. Pause, go back down. We'll do one more. Thank you. Can you do those two reps sideways for the yes. Thank you. So same thing, all very controlled. Up, down, up, down. Cool. Perfect. So next movement in our workout one for the day is what we call an inchworm. So our team will go into a press-up position. Come slightly back, Martin, keep coming back, thank you. And now what Martin is going to do is going to walk his hands back towards his feet, but he's going to keep his knees straight, only as far as he can go. And he'll stop, and he'll walk his hands back out. Okay, and again, now he wants to reduce the sway in the hips. Martin, can you do a side overview for me, please? Yes. Thank you. The key here, guys, is to make sure that we're not swaying our hips and we're keeping the steps very small. Down. And one more. Less sway on the hips. Nice and still. And you can stand up. Our next movement in workout one is what we call a glute bridge or a hamstring bridge. So Martin can sleep on the ground. Okay, I want you to keep your feet sort of shoulder width apart. Okay, your knees are going to stay apart. Head on the ground, down, fully relax, back up, 
and squeeze the glutes. Can we do two reps on the side, please? Okay, head down. I want you to come up and hold it there. The key here to make sure is we're not arcing our back. Push that down a bit and tighten the glutes. Go down, back up, and go back down. Good. Okay, next uh, exercise in our workout one is mountain climbers. All right, so Martin is going to go in a press up position. All right, so Martin is going to line himself up, slide lower back, and he's going to drive his knees up and down to his hands in a controlled motion. And when you're stable and comfortable, you can take it into running action. Good. Can we do a side on view, please? And let's go. Walking, and then he'll take it into running. Cool. Our next workout, end workout one, is the Russian twist. So we'll go down on the ground. So we'll stay seated. Bend your knees. All Martin's gonna do is either just put his hands together, hold a drink bottle or even a shoe, a ball, whatever he feels like holding. And Stephen Hoyle will just magically throw a ball in. And we're gonna do a few reps. Trying to keep his legs nice and still, he's just gonna rotate the abdominals. Can we do a side arm for them, please? Thank you. Very slow, you do not have to rush these. Take your time. No. No, we don't want to do that. Cool. Okay, and lastly, we are going to plank to finish off the workout. And that's only round one. All right, so Martin, can you go into a plank, please? Slide back for me, please. Keep coming back. Thank you. All right, so the key here in the plank, guys, is to keep our elbows directly underneath our shoulders. We do not want to arc. We do want to lend out, because that's going to be bad for the back, so we come up. But we also do not want to see Rangi Toto Island and picking your hips up so high. <laughs> this is not a good one. Okay, so you're down and we hold that there. Can we go side on, please? Thank you. Again, if you're finding it difficult, you can open your feet down so you get a bigger support. And you can also then drop to your knees if you're finding it hard. Do not arc your back. Keep this nice and steady, pretty much like a tabletop. And that's the end of our workout one for the day. It's 10 exercises that you can take your time through and from there, again, do as many rounds as you feel comfortable. Thank you, Martin. You're welcome.